Oh my, I couldn't get out. Hey guys, I'm back with a new trial global video. In today's video, we are going to be doing the new field boss. So we're going to be doing a massive faction PvP fighting to defeat the new statues, which is the new content in this game. Uh, and we're going to see what it's all about. It's my first time doing it. So I'm going to be figuring this thing out together with you guys. So if you guys missed it, or you probably have some questions, you probably, all the questions will probably be answered in this video. So I really appreciate if you give me a thumbs up, make sure you guys subscribe and let's jump into it. So we are here. You guys see this, the whole squad is here and, uh, the event is starting very soon, all right? The event has started. Is this, oh, this is the enemy statue. So. I feel like somebody, we should have somebody protecting our statue, no? I'm in uh, my battlefield spec. Now I think maybe I should have been in my uh, PvP spec. No, I mean in my dungeon spec if we're just destroying statues. You know, we are destroying them. They're not even doing damage. I'm guessing, you know what I'm guessing what happened is everybody went to server uh, channel 1. But in this, what matters, we went to channel 3. Because what matters is, is how many channels you win, right? You want to win as many channels as possible. So if everybody's going to channel 1, channel 2, 3, 4, 5, it should be easy wins. I wonder if we could change channel. Yeah, we probably have to change channel. We're going to defeat this and we're going to jump to probably the next channel. Yeah, I should definitely be using dungeon spec for this. I, I thought it was going to be like way more mass PP, but. Oh, we are smashing them right now. So the smart thing here, in my opinion, would be to have uh, different people at different channels to coordinate, right? To be like, hey, this statue is low, this statue is low. So they destroyed our channel once. Uh, we destroyed, we won channel one and we lost channel two. So now we're going to do channel four after this. There we go. Channel four. Oh, you can see, you can see the level. Oh, here we go. Fight. Oh. Here we go. PvP fight. You can see if you click here, you can see the percentages of the statues. Yeah, where's the team at? I can't even get through here. I'm gonna get smashed if I do. We should win this, and that way, if we win this, we should win three of them. So we we win total. Let's go. Let me see here. The Vulcan wins. Vulcan wins. Nyad wins. Nice. It seems like we won four channels. Yo, the blue faction is uncoordinated. Like, they're really uncoordinated because they didn't even challenge us at channel three. I thought like, oh, legendary reward. Oh my god. This. That was fast. That was really fast. So the boss should spawn uh, in 40 minutes. We finished everything in three minutes. Okay, not bad, not bad. So basically, for those who are wondering who, who how this worked, is every single channel i thought we were, ha we were going to destroy three d statues but apparently we're only supposed to destroy one maybe because it's a beta test but you have to de protect your statue and you have to defeat the enemy statue and whoever wins the most channels wins the whole thing so you want to have like you want to split up like we did we go from channel three and then we went to channel four to be smart about it right you have to talk to the other guilds probably and be like hey what channel should we go to how should we do this so we won and now we're going to wait for the boss.
All right, so the boss is going to spawn. We won Vulcan. Won, so this is the first ever boss spawning on the server. So we're going to see uh, how the boss is and uh, what drops from it. So this is how it looks, huh? Honestly, winning, if you win the... I have wrong spec on, but it should be fine. Winning the war, you get a lot of reward. And then you get the boss too at the end. You get so much rewards. It's actually insane. So basically how it worked, I was confused. Because uh, I thought you were supposed to... Uh, I thought you were supposed to destroy three statues in one channel. But apparently what it means is you're supposed to do three statues over all servers, right? So you, it's only one statue in each channel. Uh, not three in each but that makes way more sense so yeah the first the first faction to defeat the three oh the first faction to defeat three channels and uh, one statue in each, three channels wins the wins the war and we completely dominated i think we even won like four of them i'm pretty sure okay, this uh, Oh my, I couldn't get out. I'm slowed. Now, this is a fun world boss, actually. Yes, we're not going to talk about that, okay? I, I had, I was, I was lagging, literally. Okay, this boss is intense. I like it. But this is not like the other world bosses where you can just go and smash. You actually have to pay attention here. Because he slows you, so you can't like, I can't stay too close to the boss. Because if I stay too close, uh, I can't get out in time gonna stay a little range here oh can i get out without dodging no i have to dodge i have to dodge it's, it's too it's too fast oh no Ooh. oh no yo <laughs> he does not like me at all i need to get away from like the the swarm of people that's what i need to do get away from these guys Get away! Stop following me, guys! Where do you go? The dodge? This is where you do the dodge? Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. This is a fun war boss, though. I like it. I like the mechanic of it. Hey, chill, bruh! Okay, we got it. Flame God of Ragnar Tararo. That's not his name though, but whatever. Rantagoth. Moonstone, Light Sharp, Lightning Point, 80k gold. Not bad with this reward and the reward we got uh, earlier. Not bad at all. So, that was the new event, the Field Boss event that is in uh, beta drops. But basically, the war, if I didn't explain, if you didn't pay attention how it works is, there's five channels. Uh, each channel, you have to defeat the statue. Uh, whoever defeats uh, three statues, uh, the fir uh, first wins. So basically, you want to try to kind of separate, uh, kind of balance out your faction. So you win those three channels. And then after that, 30 minutes or 40 minutes after, the world boss spawns and you get extra rewards. And the world boss was fun too. But thank you guys so much for watching. That's the new content. Uh, make sure you guys check out this video right there. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.